Hello students, I welcome you all to the number one YouTube channel Aveti Learning which only works for your academic enhancement during this COVID-19 pandemic. So is my voice audible to you all? Then please write down yes in the comment box. Okay then, let's start our session. Let me tell you how can you join in our live class. Okay, it's very easy. You just have to subscribe to our channel Aveti Learning from YouTube and press the bell icon to get more updates. Okay. So these are the rules of our live class. So you just have to answer the questions which is asked okay and secondly don't chat with each other if you start chatting with each other then you will face the problem while watching the video okay and there is a special request to all of you that uh, you must make the note only after watching the video okay once you watch this video, you can watch this video again from YouTube as you have known that this is a permanent video. You can find anytime from YouTube by a single search. Okay, so just focus on this video otherwise you miss the important points. So as all of you have known that uh, Aviti Learning is the number one YouTube channel which provides you the live class at free of cost okay and in which you can find a teacher who never asks for fee so you just have to like share and subscribe to our channel and yes don't forget to comment us so as all of you have known that uh, Aveti learning provides you spoken English class and Aveti coding class that is also absolutely free of cost for all of you. So you just have to register your name in the given link and the links are at double t p s colon double slash b dot l y slash Aveti coding class. This is the link for the registration for coding class and at double t p s colon double slash b dot ly slash aveti spoken english this is the link for the registration for spoken english class okay so here is the timetable of aveti learning youtube live classes so here is a minor change so you can see that the coding class is shifted to saturday 7 30 pm and spoken english class and guest lecture series is as usual in their same time so here I am sharing you a screen in which you can see that this is a previous spoken English class which was live and uh, so many students have already joined. Okay, more than 1500 students have already registered their name for spoken English. So don't waste your time. If you want to interact with our spoken English madam directly, if you want to ask some questions to our spoken English madam directly related to the topic. So first of all, you should have to register your name in the given link and download Zoom application to attend the class. Okay, so you can join our whatsapp group now in which you can find daily session updates interact with me that means you can interact with our Aveti master teachers directly you can ask any kind of doubts any kind of questions related to your subject and we all are here to solve your problem as soon as possible okay and assignments and daily exam updates will be provided to all of you along with regular discussion and daily questions as well.
and you can check your video descriptions youtube video description through your whatsapp link so we are continuing with the chapter prepositions so in our last class we have discussed about the preposition of time so here is the quiz class so are you ready all of you very good so without wasting our time let's jump to the first quiz so you just have to fill in the blanks with appropriate prepositions and here is the first question amrit arrived here dash the weekend and the options are at in on over okay so option a is at option b is in option c is on and option d is over and as usual we have known that at is used with the exact time exact point of time and in is used for season years months etc and on is used in the particular days or particular occasions and over is genuinely the preposition of place okay at in on are also prepositions of place but they are also used as a preposition of time yes all of you have given the right answer so the right answer is at because at is used with exact point of time with the names of the and with the names of the festivals okay so here at should be used because weekend is the exact point of time now let's move on to question number 2 she plays tennis dash the morning option a above option b on option c in option d at so what is the right answer so above is used as a preposition of place on is for day or particular dates okay in is used before season month part of a day like morning evening afternoon etc and at is used before the exact point of time and with the names of some festivals okay so which is used morning is a part of day so very simple the right answer yes some of you have written the right answer okay so the right answer is in she plays tennis in the morning so in is used with seasons years parts of months days okay so here morning is a part of day okay so let's move on to question number 3 my parents presented me a bicycle dash my birthday option a at option b by option c on option d from so which is the right answer quickly write down in the comment box and let's see who have done the task first so simultaneously so many of you write at the same time 
so it's very difficult to find out any one anyways all of you I mean all the Avetians of class 10 are the genius one and we are so much happy that all of you have joined in this live class and all of you are making the best use of it so thank you so much all of you and here is the right answer okay so the right answer is on okay because on is used with specific days and dates okay here specific days means birthday is a specific day so before birthday on is used okay so it is also a preposition of time so question number four is applications must reach the office dash 20th June and the options are a for B of C at D by so what is the right answer C the first the first option for is used for a period of time okay and of is uh, used as a preposition of place okay and at is used at exact point of the time then by is used something which will be finished in near future okay so what will be the right answer applications must reach the office dash 20th June yes all of you have given the right answer the right answer is by so applications must reach the office by 20th June because it is the preposition of place and genuinely we have known that by is used to show the latest time at which an action will be finished okay so genuinely it is used with the future time okay now let's move on to question number five Ananya studies dash two hours every day and the options are at of for since quickly write down the answer in the comment box yes for a period of time so two hours is a period so the right answer is for because it is used with a period of time Ananya studies for two hours every day now let's move on to question number six okay Pratyush has been working dash morning option a in option b on option c since option d for so what is the right answer c in is used to represent season part of the day months part of months etc and on is used for specific dates or days and since is used 
when some action is started in the past and continuing at the time of speaking and for is used with the period of time so what is the right answer pratyus has been walking means the action is already started in the past and still continuing at the time of speaking so the right answer is since pratyush has been walking since morning okay so since is used with a point of time in the past from which some action begin and continues until the time of speaking okay so students today is this much so i am having some homework for you so you should have to fill in the blanks with appropriate preposition and the question is it happened dash my school days and the options are a in b on c of d at you just have to write the correct answer and send it to your whatsapp group class 10 link okay so you can contact us through aviti official whatsapp number 7894040614 so let me tell you that we are providing free online classes and learning resources to odia medium students during covid 19 pandemic which is an initiative by aviti learning so students this much okay we will meet in a new session with some new questions with some new quiz session with some new concept okay So till then don't go anywhere keep learning activate your learning enhance your learning with the authentic learning away the learning thank you